Alrighty, guys. Uh, I got the four jawed chuck uh, mounted to it. I think I don't have a chuck key for either one of my lathes. I just use a ratchet. I think this one takes the same size. Yeah. So I guess if I did want a chuck key, I'd just take an extension and weld, weld the T-bar on it. But I got the four jawed on it. I believe this is an 8-inch chuck. So uh, I shouldn't have any problems putting a piece of plate in here and bolting a cylinder in backwards. Here's one of the, the dial indicators that I ordered. Uh, for getting set up to do the cylinders there's probably going to be a little bit of a learning learning curve uh, did get uh, a plug wired on to the other lathe I got to come off that box and I just I want to make it where I can just plug it in I'll uh, probably put another plug in uh, like what I have up there uh, there too so I can run a cord over for the all the other stuff on the, the machine station but uh, yeah I'm, I'm getting there slowly but steady imagine there's gonna be quite a learning curve to doing chambers this way so we'll go down that journey together so I don't know what do you guys think you guys take it easy and have a good one